Hello and welcome to this Hasselblad X2D Spotlight. I'm Mark Whitney, Hasselblad's Photographer Relations Manager, and I'm joined here today by my colleague Chris Coos, Hasselblad's Global Technical Communications Manager. So Chris, today's Spotlight is going to be on the user interface of the X2D. Um, so I think it's fair to say that it's quite smartphone-like in its operation. Um, always been very well received by previous uh, users of the X-System cameras and indeed the H60, which yep. shares the same system. Um, yeah, so tell us a little bit more about it. So obviously we've taken that system that's been used on the previous versions uh, and basically tried to improve it in terms of legibility. So we've sharpened up the uh, icons for each of the applications. Obviously there's new functions been added in with new icons for stabilization and a few others. Uh, in terms of uh, the operation of the camera, as you say, very, very smartphone-like. So all of the usual uh, smartphone uh, gestures you would expect, so you know, double tap to zoom, swipe for the next page or next image is still there. Okay, um, so yeah, so I think it's fair to say that because of its, you know, most people are familiar with uh, smartphones nowadays, yeah, yeah. and so it's fair to say that you can pick up this camera and get up to speed with it quite quickly. Very, very based quickly, on that. yes. Okay, and um, I think it's also good to mention that it's not just the touchscreen where you can change the settings, you can also use the buttons and dials. Yes, yeah, so, to, to, so if you're wearing thick gloves or something like that, you know, where it's ice cold and you can't use your, your, your bare skin on the screen, uh, then all of the functions from the touchscreen are reproduced on the thumb wheels and the buttons. So you okay. can have full access to the camera through that system as well. Okay, thank you very much, Chris. That's a great overview of the user interface on the new Hasselblad X2D camera. If you'd like to find out more on the product or any of Hasselblad's products, you can go to the Hasselblad website at hasselblad.com. You can sign up for our newsletter for regular updates, and you can also follow Hasselblad on our social media channels. So thanks very much for joining us today, and we hope to see you again soon. Thank you very much. Thank you.